You know, people always ask me, how do you make it in show business? Well, I'll tell you, for me, it wasn't easy. It was rough. From Babylon to Broadway, oh, it was tough. When I was 15, I was writing jokes. I was doing amateur nights. I was a singing waiter. But when I started doing my act, my friends, they weren't nice at all. They never told me good show. They used to tell me everything I did wrong. Gave me all kinds of advice, my friends, all kinds of advice. You should put a song in your act, put a girl in your act. You should do more in your act. You shouldn't do an act. <laughs> and the places I worked, who were they tough? I guess the toughest one was Dominic's Black and Blue Room. Who was it tough? Why, as you went to this place, you went down two steps, physically and socially. <laughs> It was a tough place. Well, every night the boss would say the same thing to me. Be funny. My people come in to forget their troubles. I mean, how do you make a guy forget he's up for manslaughter, you know? <laughs> Boys, how are you? What time you do back for questioning? Eh? Oh, it was a tough place. You kidding? What a cigarette girl's name was Rocky. <laughs> and I remember opening night, where the star of the show was a rabies infected dog guy. And the girl singer, she was a beauty. Well, she made $50 a week and sent home 100 And then there was me. Yeah. I tell you, I tell you, folks, with me, nothing comes easy. You know, I can't lose any weight. I tried jogging. I keep running into restaurants. I tell you, with me, weight is always a problem. I mean, where I come from, I was a kid, you had to eat. You had to be big. Every day there was a fight. And you had to fight, even if you didn't want to fight. You had to fight to get out of the fight. <laughs> and sometimes we used to bet in a fight. If the guy we bet on lost, then we beat him up. <laughs> and I tell you, when I was a kid, where I come from, the most important thing was to be able to take it. I remember guys in my block who could take it. Guys like Moose, Ox, Bull, the Bear. I mean, these guys were animals. <laughs> but when they had a fight, they could take it. They never complained. They were always all right. No, I'm all right. I'm all right. Who would that guy get out of there? When he drove the car into me? Nah, it was a compact, a light car. Don't mean that. <laughs> nah, I'm all right. My teeth, my teeth are all right. I had to come out anyway. I'm all right. <laughs> and I wasn't looking for no fight, you know. He started when he banged my wrist with a pipe. And I tried to stop and grab his pipe, my wrench. He got me mad, took the pliers, he pulled my ear. So I told him, tomorrow we're going to fight again, you know. Only tomorrow, no rules. 